Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Reseteer. Uh, okay, well, when we last left off, we just learned about buying items from customers. And since we're fully stocked, I think we're just going to spend the day selling our stuff. Hey there, Louie. Ooh, leather armor, eh? <laughs> you already have one of those. Once again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How about 130? That's about right. Yay. Hello. Oh, cloth cape, eh? How about for 140%? Okay. Let's give him a little discount. <laughs> Ah, it's a fine price. Aren't I so courteous? You sell this to me? Hmm, chestnut, eh? Sure. What? Crazy old man, get out of my store! This is a present for my brother. That's adorable. <laughs> These little girls have no money. Oh my! <laughs> Stupid little girls. Came to sell this. I'll buy that for fifty percent. Well, it seems reasonable. All right. All right, I bought a beef bowl. <laughs> Let's just attract every sort of weird person. I'll have a bow, a chestnut, a beef bowl, <laughs> and some slime fluid. <laughs> Louis back. Ah, uh, little girls are back too. Wow, that's a lot of people. You sure can purchase that. You're right, I can go a little lower than that. You're welcome. You stupid little girls. Whoa! <laughs> That's expensive. I'll buy it though, for sure. <laughs> Fucking little girls, man, I tell you. How about 65? That was expensive. But I'll be able to sell it for a lot. Okay. Chestnut, is it? Ha! <laughs> your haggling skills win, miss. I'll take it. Huzzah. What's up? He's looking for one of these. Still hungry, eh? You know, I can't pay that much. How about 130? Okay. Ah, the beef bowl I just purchased. I guess I could. What? Buy my items, stupid old people. Ah, you want it now. <laughs> Are you willing to pay a decent price for it? <laughs> How about 128%? What? That's what Tear told me to sell them for, though. <laughs> ah, man. Mild schedule management for you from now on to ensure you're working in an effective manner. What? Get the fuck out. I already know all this. The clock's been broken up into four areas. <laughs> okay. 
It's up to me what I do and when I do it, so shut the fuck up. So you can go out and do as many things as you want with one hour, or one quarter of the day. Load dungeoning will take two. God, I don't care. I know all this. I've already explained it to the viewers as well. Stupid fairy, shut up. Let's put out this amazing statue that I bought. And let's put out some more slime stuff. You'll eventually end up with a lot of these on display. <laughs> eventually you'll just be better off selling them to the uh, merchant. Mention skills. <laughs> Friggin' little girls. Oh, she wants to buy it. Didn't actually say. <sighs> Stupid, get out of my store! <laughs> Don't come back. Sell that. Come on. What are you gonna do with it? <laughs> you don't need it. You want some slime fluid? You're right, I can. Enjoy your fluid. Chocolate bar. Alright. Someone buy my statue. Let's buy that for half. Oh, a just combo. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Stupid little girls. Do you actually ever buy stuff? <laughs> she put up a sign that says no little girls in the storefront. Let's put the sandals up here. What is the store atmosphere like? Plain. I gotta get it down to dark, I guess. <laughs> get rid of all these little girls. <laughs> hey! Alright, one more time. Oh, look, no little girls. Oh, I do have sandals. I'm willing to sell that for 140% of its base price. I don't seem to be gaining a whole lot of money. I'm just kinda floating around the same amount. I'm just buying up all my slime fluid. What is he using it for? <laughs> I'm curious. Oh, an orange. One of my higher priced items. Level up. Hey, Louie. <laughs> your chocolate bar is your fairly heirloom. 
Why are you selling off your family chocolate bar? The day's up. I actually made profit even though I bought that statue. Not bad. Seem more or less used to the basics of running an item shop. Of course. You not always be certain that a customer will know what they want when they come in. What do you mean? They may come in thinking, what should I make for dinner? What will be a good weapon, and so forth. They will not be quite sure what exactly they wish to purchase. In such case, we must provide them with advice. Ah, oh, so I offer something for them. <laughs> Inquire as to whether or not we have something they seek. That is, when you may suggest an item you think they would like. Huh. No pressure then, none at all. So you can only offer stuff that are not on the counters. Interesting. If you sell weapons and armor to your adventurer friends, they will equip the items you sell them. Meaning, of course, that if you sell items to them, then we do not need to lend them any items at the start of a dungeon. And we'll be able to bring back more items for our own use. Even if an adventurer must retreat while in a dungeon, the equipment is not lost since it is in their possession. Selling better equipment to our adventuring friends is a good idea, even if you must undersell to them a little. <laughs> Accessories work the same way, so think about it. Whoa, I hope I can keep track of all this. Alright. Affirmatification? <laughs> That's not a real word. I'll sell you this. How about the steel sword? A weapon, however. <laughs> Would you like a windbreaker? You can smack someone with it. Uh, something like this. How much is it? One more. Uh. Yeah, yeah, let's get it over with. I think I'll spend the rest of this day selling items as well. We only got a few more days until it's due date. Put a chocolate bar up here. Actually, let's put the cherries up here too. Alright. I hate little girls. I hate them so much. <laughs> so weirded out. What? Why does he want so many of these? What does he use them for? I don't know. I'm gonna keep putting them out if he keeps wanting them, but... Man. You'd like some food, would you? I don't have any food. Oh, I could pick anything. How would you like a beef bowl? I think this is what you're looking for. Aye, that'll do. No one has that kind of money. Madness! <laughs> well, they went home. Maybe I shouldn't try to sell them the most expensive thing I have. I'm good at buying stuff. <laughs> I 
I'm not supposed to be a buyer though. <laughs> The little girls are around the 14% above normal. A hat. I don't have a hat. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe you can use this as a hat. <laughs> okay, so apparently the merchant guy is not using it for a hat. <laughs> Uh, I would end this video here, but let's just use, spend the rest of this day selling stuff. Then we'll end the video. Cherry. Okay. Let's go 125. That'll do. Need to start selling stuff. I can't be haggling for the best possible price. I don't have a scarf. How about a raincoat? <laughs> Too bad, Louis. Chocolate. He's willing to, s to buy at 130. Let's just to be safe. Forgot to put up more slime juice for him. If you need help with your pension, I don't think selling me an apple is going to help. <laughs> she died, my grandmother told me to sell this off. I forgot to trouble with the chocolate bar. <laughs> That's too funny. <laughs> Man, I'm buying up stuff like a motherfucker. Sir, what's his face? Yes, it is that cheap. Damn children. <laughs> you guys. I'm a store. I can buy stuff anytime I want. Food, eh? How about a beef bowl? <laughs> No. I mean, it is expensive for a bowl of beef, but... There we go. Finally sold something worth money. Now I don't have to worry about the payment. Showcase item. Man, this guy's so poor. No! I will not buy it for any more. Chocolate. Nope. <laughs> Stupid old man. What do you need? Let me guess. Slime juice. Oh no, he wants a chocolate bar. A little bit. Alright, let's spend one more quarter selling stuff. I think tomorrow we'll go out on an adventure. selling things a lot more now that I'm not going for the 
higher prices. Sure is for sale. Alrighty. Thanks for all your help. Nice profits. Exceeded expectations. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I guess next video we'll go on another adventure and explore some dungeons. See you later.